Hi everyone and welcome back. In this video I want to show you how to use a new AI tool called Make Build by Figma. So this tool will help you transform your Figma design frames into fully functional code without writing any single line of code. So without further ado, let's begin. Before we begin, I need to mention this. Figma Make is not available for starter plan. It is only available for professional organization or enterprise plan. So that being said, let's go and open our Figma professional team. And let's go here in our drafts section. Let's go to create and let's hit make to create a new make file so it will create a new file and here is the basic interface now how make work let me grab a prompt here i just made and let's go to make and past it so the prompt says create a modern travel app UI with four horizontal cards. Each one represents a country. Each card has rounded corners, soft shadows, and a glossomorphic style. Display country name with flag, this is the content, and this is the hover effect on hover card, slightly lift with soft glow, and suggests smooth transition through visual cue, and so on. If I click here, all right. As you can see, this is the first attempt and we have a nice, beautiful, modern card design of our travel app. All right, let's see if we you know, shrink our view, it is responsive as you can see. Now, the good thing with make it is that we can uh, edit this into our preview window, all right, without touching any line of code. So if we click here, point and edit, we can go here in, for example, a text, and we have our toolbar. We can, you know, just make our text change its size we can change its color all right and also we can change the spacing of our card for example the paddings like this the margins can also change the border radius and also if you want to change something that we don't have in the toolbar we can use here the prompt we can prompt it to for example add a blur effect to the background image all right so if we hit send it will rewrite again our code and hopefully it will add our modification so bear in mind that this is AI it doesn't give you exactly what you want but it is getting there all right, so now here we go. Our image are blurred. And we can edit also, we can also hit this and edit the code. When we click in any component and want to inspect our code, you can go to source and here we go, it select the code part of that uh, component and it will tell you that this is a div 
and also it will select it here you can prompt uh, the modification of your selection in the prompt or from the toolbar alright next let me show you how to transform a UI image uh, into a code alright let's close this file and create a new make file so let's go here in our prompt and let's grab an image from our desktop hit open and here I have brief prompt gonna prompt make to this is you know I'm gonna give him a quick overview of what the image is and also add some effect this is a modern travel UI with four horizontal cards on hover cards slightly lift up with a soft glow shadow add a nice soft glow shadow under the cards and accent it on hover so this is a quick prompt gives more context to make all right so let me know in the comment you know how good the first attempt is now the good thing I want to try is responsive as you can see it is responsive all right now this is the first attempt like I showed you previously you can go here and edit uh, our cards or the code inside it. Next we we'll see how to import a frame into make and transform it into code. Let's go and create a new make file. So let me close this and create again a new file. All right, I'm gonna go to my Figma design file and I will go and transform this full home page, you know, with lots and lots of layers, buttons, images, and try to transform it into code. Let's copy let's go here and hit command V to past as you can see it is importing my frame and I'm gonna tell him transform this home page design into react cut that's it I'm gonna hit send All right, that's really good. It didn't take so much, just a minute or so. And look at the results. It's amazing. Let me go back to my frame. Here we are. As you can see the details, let's compare it. Uh, it looks good you don't have the hover let's go here here we have a problem I think this is the image is over the buttons but no, that's not problem but let's see let's go and see the code let's go to app Where is the code? I think this is the code. All right, as you can see, and we can, you know, 
edit and tell make to add hovers uh, to change things from the toolbar and so on and so forth and we can edit here from the editor to get as close as possible now all that is great now, I should mention that this is AI it doesn't give you always the best result I've tested uh, for the first time it was giving me some bad results sometimes good sometimes bad but it does the heavy work now the last thing and the most important part is how to export this code or download it to your disk you can go here to code tab and click here into download code and it will give you a zip file with all the files and code of your project you can also share this file with anyone all right exactly like you are sharing a figma folder all right this is it that was the end of this video and hopefully i will see you in another video